Okay, now time okay. to continue. So okay. speaking of tits... <sighs> Hi, Solar. You're the one that brought it up. I don't know why you're mad. <sighs> Are you really surprised he's fucking Solar? I'm not mad. <laughs> it's just like... Uh, should I expect seeing that coming? <laughs> Shit, I need to find... A dancing dick out there. Dancing dick? It's a dancing green dick. Piccolo's dick. Oh, sounds about right. <laughs> Crap. My dick fell off! Damn it. I was trying not to hit him. Actually, let me see if I can hit him with a hook shot. Yeah. A bush was supposed to injure him. Okay. How's the chat today? Also, yes, this yeah. Don't mind me. Let's see five rubies. Happiness increased. Uh, five rupees. In total, your happiness is five. You may be happier by one step. Okay. Um. Wheel of Steel, we've had quite a conversation of, or God knows how much shit. I remember Let's... there was something kind of like this in Oracle of Ages where, like, uh, there was a fountain, and there was a sign outside the fountain that said, Please do not throw anything into the fountain. So me being me, I threw a bomb into the fountain, and then, like, this fairy came out of it and said, Hey, you dropped a bomb in here. What kind of bomb was it? And the options were a gold bomb, a silver bomb, or a regular one. And I was like, you know, I've heard this fable before, so I'm going to say a regular one. And it's like, oh, you're honest, so I'm going to increase your bomb bag size for you. Oh, damn. <laughs> oh, well, thanks. All right, then. <laughs> yeah, so, like, for, for reference, this was actually a reference to one of Aesop's fables where this guy, like, this lumberjack, he was, he was fucking cutting down trees by the river, and, like, he ended up dropping his axe into the river, and, like, one of the fucking, one, one of the gods came down to him. I forgot which god it was. Doesn't really matter. Came down to him and said, oh, you, you, you've you lost your tool in this river. And so he goes down and gets it. And he's like, he brings up, like, a golden axe. He's like, oh, is this the, is, is this what you lost? And he says, no, I mean, I wish it was, but it's not. So then he goes down again. And he brings down a fucking, he brings out a silver axe. And he says, oh. Is this the one you lost? It's like, no, that's not, that's not mine. So then he goes down, he brings up his actual axe. He's like, oh, yeah, that's mine. Thanks. He's like, oh, you're honest. So you can have this gold <laughs> axe and this silver axe <laughs> as a reward. And then somebody else heard this story and they're like, oh, you know what? I'm going to do the same shit. So he goes to the river. He throws. Oh, axe my God. He throws his axe in, and then the fucking god comes down again and says, Oh, you fucking dropped your axe. Here, let me go get it for you. And he brings up the gold axe. He's like, Is this yours? And he says, Oh, yeah, it totally is. Oh! And, he, and so he says, Oh, well, yeah, you're full of shit. So <laughs> not only am I not giving you this one, I'm leaving your actual axe at the bottom of the river, fuckboy. <laughs> I really love how you like narrate the fucking story. It's it's so amusing. That 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 is, by the way, not at all the actual direct wording of how it goes. I know, but, but still. But that's basically the cliff notes. <laughs> Solar cliff notes are best cliff notes. <laughs> so that's how I learned that being honest was usually the best way to go when it came to video games. And this is why Applejack is underappreciated. Mm. Um, yep. Uh, I still remember hearing the story about uh, the Golden Goose, and uh, you, you know who the odd one out is, right? Like, we talking about a specific instance, or like... No, 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 the, um, the YouTube channel. I can't say that I do. Okay, nope. you'll probably know him when you watch his channel. Basically, he he vlogs, but he draws a cartoon character of himself, and he talks about his personal experiences. 
Um, like, it, it's kind of like, not a stick figure, but his, like, his head is like, uh, it, it's mostly circular, uh, body portions formed into one. <laughs> <laughs> I know, like, trying to give a full description on, you know, a, a picture has a thousand meanings compared to just words in and of itself. Anyway, mm -hmm. he, he was talking about, uh, you know, the whole Derek Savage issue with, uh, I hate everything. And the best example that he gave of what defines Derek Savage's behavior is the farmer and the golden goose. The golden goose was able to lay one golden egg a day. And because uh, the farmer wanted more, he killed the goose, cut it off its head, thinking that it would make more, but he only wound up killing the goose. Yeah, you see, that's where... That's where I'm like, where is your logic, friend? And you're like, oh, I have an animal that produces precious metal once a day, and I can go and sell that, and, like, I essentially have, as far as I'm concerned, an infinite source of precious metal. I mean, yeah, it's a certain amount per day, but still, that shit sells for a lot. Why, under any circumstance, would you think, oh, let me kill this and cut it open, because that way it'll give me all the shit at once? It's like, no, bitch. That ain't how it works. Wait, I think I know what I'm supposed to do. Because I remember that there was a portal at the mountain cave. Yeah, let's go here. Talk to this guy. Sorry if I interrupted anything. No, it's fine. <laughs> oh. oh, it seems, uh, I think Nightfall has a ba- God damn it! Now I have to go and restore my health. Fucking boulders. Where do these goddamn rocks come from? The ground. Uh. These tumbling rocks just come falling down. Oh shit, 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 don't touch me! Probably further Fuck. up the mountain then. It's a landslide. Ugh. Shaking. God, that drives me crazy. Yeah, this just reminds me of Death Mountain in fucking Ocarina of Time. Except for you could just hold up the shield and just run up the mountain and not worry about Jack doodly. I'm more of reminded of the turd balls from Conker's Breakfast Day. Oh, don't even get me started on those. I <laughs> have yet to play that game. Oh, boy. My parents bought me that game because they were like, oh, yeah, it's, it's a video game about a cute little squirrel. It's certainly... Completely eight. ignoring that, that it has an amateur rating and there's a fucking the disclaimer thing. on the label. Here's the thing. Like, when it first came out, my parents got it for me. And then, like, within my... that first week, it came out on the news saying, hey, it didn't have an M rating originally. What? It was, it was originally, it like, not rated, wasn't it? Yeah, it was originally not rated. Yeah. Oh, shit. So my father shit. got concerned when he heard such moaning from the bedroom, and it was just the flower and the bee. Oh, I remember that. <laughs> I remember that one. That was, that was a fun time. The birds and the bees. <laughs> the flower and the bees. Oh, pretty that, much. That, I'm pretty sure that flower taught a lot of people how to masturbate. <laughs> <laughs> So basically, it has this flower, right? And she's got huge boobs. Like a real <laughs> set of honkers. <laughs> Talking a major set of badonkers. <laughs> <laughs> that is literally all that I need to say about it because that's all it is. It's a flower with giant tits. And you can bounce on them to get you money. Can, and you can bounce on them to acquire currency. Oh, mm -hmm. my God. With which you can disregard women with. <laughs> Which, to be fair, is kind of what you do for like 90% of the game because you're like ignoring your girlfriend. <laughs> oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. No! Ah! Uh, get out of here. Get out of here. Do, 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 do. Yeah, my favorite boss fight in that game was probably the fucking the boiler. 
Oh, the ball crushing uh, attack. I've seen yes. the gameplay. I've yeah. seen the gameplay of the um, of uh, Conqueror's Bad Fur Day, and I found it hilarious at like how creative some of the attacks were. Ninety percent of the game was just references to other movies and/or games. Yeah, they're either references or it's straight up uh, raunchy humor. Because I remember, like the the last little segment of the game, it was basically it was it was. He was fucking the Matrix and Alien. Yeah. The, the um, last, the final boss of that game was straight up just a Xenomorph, and you got into a little power loader, and, and he says the fucking line, and it was great. It's like, get away from her, you bitch. Yeah. I was so happy when that happened. Uh, I also saw a clip about, um, I think it was a squirrel. I don't know. You feed it something, and if you get it too much, he explodes. Oh no! You you, you have to make him explode. There's yeah, yeah. Literally no other way. Because he's it's like, like oh, oh no! I like eating this cheese. Okay, sure. You, it was you a give mouse. Him some cheese. Yeah. yeah. No, he was a it mouse. It was a mouse. Like, yeah. It was like, oh sure. Let me let me get you this cheese, fam. He's like, oh yeah, I'd like some more. Okay, sure. Here's some more cheese. One more ought to do it. Okay, sure. Here oh go. no! I think I ate too much. And then he blows up. <laughs> yeah, like it gets like. <laughs> It's 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 hysterically bloody. It's it's fucking ridiculous. It's, it's, yeah, no, it was pretty hilarious. Oh yeah, no, it's that's that's glorious. <laughs> I'm still a little traumatized by a little bit. Um, when you have to leave the baby dinosaur just to get crushed. Oh, don't even get me started there. It's like uh, <laughs> I don't want to. And then there was the teddy bears. Oh my god, the fucking look. It took me a while to actually get through that one. That one did take a while, yeah. Mm -hmm. You know it's still- It was mostly the lasers. <laughs> <sighs> the hallway. <laughs> Don't even get me fucking started on the hallway. <laughs> The, Not uh, to mention where it's like, oh yeah, let me just turn this corner and I'm shish kebab. All right, thanks. Yeah, actually, there is something I also do remember from the game, and uh, that's uh, getting involved with a couple of fish, and then he let out some kind of bulldog fish, and it just kills uh, off. Uh, yeah, uh, it, it, it's because they fucking juju you out of some money. They, 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 they fucking juju you hardcore. It's like, oh yeah, <laughs> well, it's like, oh, if you do this thing for us, we'll give you ten percent of the money that we get. Okay, sure, and you go and do the things, and you're like, okay, yeah. Here, you'll get your dollar now. Wait, what? One dollar? Yeah, you said ten percent. Yeah, it's ten dollars. You bitch! The bitch! Fuck. All that effort just for one buck. You're just you're that fucking old lady from that Simpson episode, where yeah, Bart. Yeah, ha uh, you'll get your dollar. It's like uh, actually, how about this? Um, I'll keep all of it. You fuck. And then uh, and then they all get fucking murdered. So you know they can't. Payback's a bitch. And then they all get brutally fucking murdered by the bulldog, so you know they can't trace it back to you. So, life is good. <laughs> <laughs> I committed mass murder on at least four catfish today. Life is good. <laughs> God, you would do a... You can do a very good impression of, um... What's his name? Uh, Critical on YouTube. I, I I wasn't doing an impression of him, but I have been told that by other people. Hey guys, it's critical. Watch the other stupid up, guys. It's critical. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, today, we're gonna be taking beef testosterone into the multiplayer universe. <laughs> <laughs> Don't pick Dodson. Why? We're playing in the flyweight division, aka Demetrius Johnson territory. What's the point of playing anybody else? Here we go, boys. Beef testosterone versus somebody that isn't Mighty Mouse Johnson. I mean, I don't have any beef with Dodson, but I'm gonna have to really spank that ass real quick. <laughs> there we go. That's my glove. Hey, Joe, Come on. Close the door. Sign of respect. Come on, touch my glove. You fell for it, pussy fire. Oh, fuck! Alright, here we go. First way to enter the dungeon in this one is by falling in a hole. Oh. Yeah, very interesting. That's not just a KO. That man is. Oh, Wallmasters, I hate these assholes. Oh. 
The top remember, of those trees look like a bunch of buttholes. I, I remember seeing this one comic that was like- Ow! Oh, fuck! It was bouncing that, off like a goddamn pinball. That was basically like fuck. making fun of the wall masters. It was like, Duh. oh no, there's a child inside of this tomb. So the wall master comes down, grabs Link, and it puts him at the start of the dungeon. He's like, there you go. Go outside and be with your friends. Fuck it! America! <sighs> yep. Same, man. God you enjoy fucking America? damn it, man. <laughs> I'm surrounded by a bunch of baddies. Overwhelmed. Uh, you! Fuck off! God! Don't worry, pussy fart. My sword is justice and you can't escape the long dick of the law. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> He's trying to give me the bad touch from the ceiling. <laughs> fucking wall masters, man. It's not just that they creep you. They're just fucking annoying. They're very touchy. It, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, fuck me sideways. I can't go over there. Ow! Fuck! <laughs> oh. That's Key's job. Everybody... Okay, that... Yeah, that, that's, that, that's nothing new. <laughs> that fruit was hanging lower than my testicles. <laughs> Uh, I don't know anymore. All I know is, fuck. Uh, I I lost the ferry. I I can only say that much. Hmm. All right, so let's see where this one leads to. Okay. Oh, it's these assholes again. There's a lot of skulls in this particular game. Well, that's also because it's the, um... This is the the Dark World, so... There's a uh, lot... okay. I've never played this game, so... Although, to be fair, even in the Light World, when it came to uh, dungeons, um, there were always, like, skulls to remove instead of, like, I don't know, pottery. Ah. Yeah. Everything in this room is dead, just like this poor individual's dreams of masturbation. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, that is awesome. Okay, is it worth it to actually go over... Nope, it's... I don't think it's worth it. Well, shit! I don't have the boss key! Oh, fuck. It's these assholes. Okay. Um, I think what you're supposed to do cool. is you're supposed to save the one that's, like, on your side for last, and then you hook... Like yeah, I really should have thought about that. All right, well, they, they, they respond when I come back here. Yeah, exactly. Or not! Shit. Am I able to... Okay, good. I could just re-enter back here. Okay. And a thought just occurred to me. I'm going to have to figure... What... Oh, wait, wait, wait. I've been here before on the, uh, on the other end. You, stop sparking. There. Wait, wait, wait. Let me get that heart. Gotta get as much health as possible because... I'm gonna name that one. No! God damn it. You gotta be spanking my urethra. <laughs> wow, that was crazy. Alright, let's try this again. Yoink. 
Boingy, boingy. And that was worth not a thing. But I'm not too surprised here, given that, you know, it's just a giant treasure chest that requires the boss key. Fuck you! God damn it, I'm already low on health. Ugh. And I don't have any keys, so I can't really do much there. What? <sighs> I feel like maybe you have to get all the skulls off in the room before that one. Before Ugh. you go into, before you go out there and do that one. That's that's just me though. I don't know. Oof. Ugh. You, dick face. Get out of here. You can't escape the long dick of the law. Don't you dare take my fucking rupees. <laughs> the thing was gonna try to steal and fucking rob me? Oh no! I'm gonna give you a fucking slap on the wrist. No. Judge, help me. He's trying to steal my shuckles. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's see. Hook shot. What the? Why isn't it work? There we go. Ah! Ah, oh, just what we... Okay, you know what? I've had enough of this shit. All of you, fuck off. I froze them. Okay, that's a start. You! Get out of here! Nobody likes you. Nobody likes you, hand... Nobody likes to be touched by you. Fuck off. I swear, I get so many fucking comments where people are like, okay, where did the Landmaster touch you? I hope you realize the Landmaster is a tank in Star Fox and not the, and, and not the creature that brings you to the start of the dungeon. Wait, are they the same name or no? No, you're thinking of a Wallmaster. Landmaster is a tank in Star Fox. What the dick is wrong with me getting names mixed up? First this, then the Krusty Burger, Krusty Krab shit. I was trying to make a joke, and I fucked it up. Dead. Fuck yeah. you, Wallmaster. I get a complaint constantly asking, where did they touch you? Wallmaster, do you need a hand, <laughs> Golden? No! I know where you touch! Get away from me! I touched by Uncle Jimmy from the ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna need you to maintain a safe distance of at least 30 light years from me at all times. <laughs> and Wallmaster, uh, why don't you have a seat right over there? What kind of skull is that? Oh, I think I know what that is. That's the boss you're going to be fighting. Oh, okay. No. <clears throat> Ugh, Christ. I'm, s I'm like down to one fucking heart. Oh, am I supposed to fall in here? I hope to God I don't get involved in two. It's probably going to be a shit ton of it. No? Oh, 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 okay. All right, cool, cool. I I'm cool with this. Except the fucking Wallmaster returns. Seriously, dude, I am not interested in being in your presence. Fuck! He got me! And that didn't do shit. No. Hands off! Don't touch me. Don't touch me there! No.
No. I suck my dick, Wallmaster. It doesn't have a mouth, but it could probably give you a really good hand job. Boo! <laughs> oh no! Ow. I just wasted a fucking arrow. Oh, shit. Well, fuck, where do I go? There has to be a way somewhere. Oh, wait, hang on. Hit the switch. Hang on. Okay, I just I just hit another switch. All right, I think I can pass through. Yep, I can pass through. All right, good. All right, let's check this side first. Oh! God damn it. Okay, I, I think I'm down to my last fucking fairy. Go away! Gotcha, you fucking piece of dog shit. Oof. Yeah. Alright. Let's see. Let's pull it this way. Whoa, 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 whoa. Shit. I gotta... I gotta... Give it a little more distance. Yeah, you touched the fucking statue and not me. Nice try, dipshit. This is how thing from Adam's family gets up chicks. Wait, what? <laughs> what? What? I got violated again? Are you kidding me? You fucking asshole. Uh oh. And I was doing it so fucking good. My ah! dick fell off. Well, my dick certainly didn't fall off. It was touched! Fuck, fuck, fuck. I hate these mummy guys. I think those are supposed to be vulnerable to fire. fire well, I don't have anything. God damn it! God. Whoa, shit. Ah, <clears throat> great. I'm dead. All right. Lovely. I, I, I need a minute here.